Hello everyone, I am George and today's video is all about how to create an Android application using an MIT app inventor 2 to control or send a command to Arduino Uno via HC06 Bluetooth module. For today's tutorial, what we need are an Arduino Uno microcontroller board, of course a breadboard, an LED, a 10 kilo ohms resistor, an HC-06 Bluetooth module, and some jumper wires. So, let's get started to install this one. We need to connect our LED to the breadboard. So I'm connecting the cathode to the ground. I will add some resistor so that I will not burn the LED. Then I will connect the HC-06. Then I will add a power. So the first pin at the back is BCC. I'm connecting this one to the BCC. Next is the ground. I will connect it to the ground. Then the RXTX, third pin and the fourth pin. Okay. Now I will make a connection for our LED and for the power supply. The LED indicator will be connected to digital pin 13. The 5 volts and the ground will be connected to the ground and the 5 volts. Then, our RXTX. So, green is TX. I will put this one to pin 2 and RX to pin 3. Digital pin 2 and pin 3. That's it. We will connect our Arduino Uno to the computer. Now we will make an Arduino sketch by opening the Arduino IDE. Okay, now we are having a new and blank sketch. First, we include software serial which will be used for the HC-06 then we define the LED to pin 13 we define HC 06 RX pin to pin 2 we define HC 06 TX pin to pin 3 then we will connect our we will initialize our software serial software serial We name this one as HC06, our RX, this one, our TX, this one. Then we will create a bool LED state variable, we initialize this one as false. Then we will create a string variable for the command received from a MIT App Inventor. We will initialize the HC-06, HC-06 that begin with a baud rate of 9600 bits per second. Next, we set the 
direction of the LED pin as output. Then we digital write to LED pin this LED state. Now let us go to the loop. So we will constantly pulling the status of HC06 if there's an available uh, command received where this one is more than zero. When there's a command received, we will save this one uh, to the command string and hc 6 read when there is a command available if command is not equal to blank what we will do first we trim this is to make sure that additional uh, line feed is not included. So, remove added line feed in transmit. So, if the command is equal to 1, to turn on the LED we will turn on the LED so LED state is equal to true else if command receive is equal equals to Zero to turn off so we will turn off the LED LED stay is equal to false then we will clear the command variable Variable. After that, we write digital write okay, this one. So we will save this one. I think this one is enough. Save this one. Save us. MIT up inventor sending command so long so I'm going to first make sure that the board is selected under the tools board Arduino Uno after that go to tools port and make sure that the serial com port is properly selected so here it's selected next after we save we can upload then we can test our application so now it's compiling now uploading next done uploading so now, our board is now ready for testing.
we will install the Android application which is created using MIT App Inventor 2. I already put it in our Android phone. See? MIT App Inventor sending APK. We will just install this one. Install anyway. Installing. Send up for scanning. No need. Don't send. Then we can open. MIT App Inventor sending was built for an older version. Just click OK. Yay! Now our setup is now ready for testing. As of now, the C the 06 is not connected to our application. To connect, we need to make sure that the Bluetooth of our mobile phone, Android phone, is turned on. Here, we are already turned on. And make sure to first connect to the HC06. Next, we need to press the scan button. And as you can see, HC06. So, select this one. And let us just wait until it's connected. Now connected. We can also try to disconnect to make sure that we are connecting properly. So when we disconnect, the status is disconnected. And the LED in the HC-06 is blinking. So let us scan again and connect. Select HC-06. After connecting, you may observe that LED indicator in the HC-06 is stable. So now connected and the LED indicator in the HC-06 Bluetooth module is now stable and not blinking. Our test LED is now turned off. So when we send turn on LED, Let's say press this one. The LED is now turned on. We can turn it off by pressing the turn off LED button. As you can see. Turn on again. Turn off. Turn on. Turn off. And also you may observe that the status or the state of the LED. So that's all everyone. I hope you like this video. Please. Leave your comments and suggestions in the comment box. Please consider subscribing. Thank you and have a good day. Bye!